All right, what's going on guys? So I'm here at the new unit, uh, 303 at ASU 20. And before I move in, I'm actually gonna take photos and videos and give them off to ASU 20 to use for future vacancies. Because at ASU 20, if you live and work there, you need to volunteer five hours. And this is a great opportunity for me to work on more of my photography skills for interior real estate. So we have a tripod because you need a tripod when doing real estate photos. I use a tripod for most of my interior photos, uh, usually because it's too dark in most of these places, but also it's easier to frame your shots um, without having to worry about your hands moving while using the camera. And then also over here, I have my SKB case, and inside I have my cameras that I use for most of my projects. Um, it's a really cool case, shout out to Hunt. And then also, we have my Canon R5, and I will be shooting with the 15 to 35 millimeter lens because it's a very wide lens, and I'm really happy just with the quality of this guy. And I also shoot in the long exposure mode, or on the camera, it's the bulb. And I have a touch screen. There's a two second timer before the shutter goes off, which is really good because you want nice, stable uh, photos. Sometimes they will get blurry if the tripod is moving from touching, so definitely use the timer. All right, so first thing I'm gonna do is just set up my tripod. And then I'm gonna take my R5 with my tripod plate. And I'm gonna throw it on this silk guy. Tighten that up. Actually, we're gonna shoot in manual. And so I'm gonna change my ISO. I'm gonna leave it down to maybe 200, but I'm also gonna change my F-stop to about 22, um, just so that we can have really sharp images. But then I'm gonna make sure I change my shutter speed just so that we allow as much light as possible inside the room. Let's go one and a half seconds. Okay, now that we have the camera ready to go, let's find our first corner. So we're gonna back it up and go over here. I always try to make sure that my photos are upright because with urban exploring or even just doing like corporate real estate photos, you want it nice and upright, lines are straight. So I think we got that corner pretty done and now we'll move to our next corner.